to summoner's rift. Oh, shield. Johnny, Dawa, Door. Wait, what? Oh, damn it. I hate it when that happens. David. But, uh. Yeah, we're going for more. Not natural. Minions have spawned. As you can see, me and my pal Scythen decided to do a little off meta game after all. In fact, three of them in a row. Probably shouldn't have started W there, but oh well. I just want to give him the most comfortable clear as I could because it is not really matter to have brand in the jungle. He was gonna go Darius, but he got banned. At first, really. Uh, auto shield screwed both of us. He gave me my best roll. Eh. I want to go Pantheon support. But, uh. He wanted to go Darius mid. Instead. He got jungle and Darius got banned. So I just went with brand. And me I stuck with Pantheon because why not? Otherwise it actually would have been a challenging game. Besides I did tell him we don't have a lot of AP and Jonah don't do much damage. So he decided instead of going Rango or anything like that to pick Bran. I try to make him go Karthus. Just didn't want to go Carthus. You know he's really good with Carthus. He's only played him in the mid lane. Actually, we always should have gone for the Bible there and not wasted that. He's not that good at the dig I assume. I played against a lot of Fiora matches in the past. And I would have pocked the vital and ran away. Instead of just look like it's going in and just walk out. Also if I was confident in my abilities, I would have stayed in and Hit the tower a few times, but as you can see, that Gragas was in that side of the jungle and Fiora was heading back, so smart decision on basing on my behalf. And of course, that gave me enough gold to get Phage. 
and some boots. And yes, I typed to them that, uh, actually no, I was going to type to them that Gragas was heading towards but, uh, mid lane. I decided, nah. I'd force Gragas back up eventually. I'm sure everyone here would want to know what rank that Z is. At the time of this video, our game, he's actually level 27, so not even ranked yet. And he played Z very goodly. Also, that Gragas counter. Chuckling because he well can. I got stuck on a wall there. I was gonna go back that way, but I said nah. What's the worst that Fio could do to me? Sitting for a bit though because I just wanted to keep pushing. Like push, build up the minions and stuff. Have a big minion wave. And then want Fiora to go in like that. Should take a lot of minion damage. gone in. Honestly, she should have just not gone in because now she has to base or she would have died. And just as my ability was up, she seen me coming. She made the right choice of just moving. If only I had enough mana to ult. <laughs> Yeah, I tell my team I force Fiora to back. And I tell them what TP is down because not everyone pays attention to the mini map. Red team double kill. Oh, I also tell him her ult is down. And now I go in and ult. Don't know why she thought that was a good idea. Didn't really do anything. Mostly because the battle wasn't facing that way. Rampage. That was a nice prediction down her point. 
It's also a nice reaction speed to just move the fuck out of the way after throwing that spear. Didn't want to get slowed again. And yeah, don't be afraid to use the spears to actually, uh, fall him. <laughs> I didn't care about that. And she went the wrong way. If she would have went the other way, she probably could have killed me. Not BMing. I'm just showing my uh, supremacy by flashing my Master 3 7 icon. Besides, if I do it enough, she'll uh, complain enough to make uh, the other people go top to try to shut me down. Happens a lot. Which is great since uh, you're taking pressure off. Uh, of your other lanes, plus your jungle could. Oh, if you had a actual jungle, you could jungle could gank. I guess it blends more into a later type of game style instead of early game jungle. Sometimes doing that will get them to act a bit aggressive. I don't know why that part glitch made two vitals right there. She used her ult, I had to flash out. But then I just get a kill at least. I'm thinking if the thing did not glitch out then gave the passive stack twice like that, I probably would have lived. I don't know why she pings enemies missing. Cause they could see I'm on a cooldown timer or a respawn timer. Oh, and yes, I was actually maxing E first. Because why not? I wanted to do more burst damage wise. I was also wondering why is she two levels at below me? when she got the kill like that. In the last hitting there, as you see, I need to get better. Well, more practice, really. She shouldn't have wasted her W like that or repose. I'm just waiting for it to get closer, but I forget how long of a cooldown her repos really is. I could have just gone in and killed her. Shut down. Blue team double kill. 
Instead of getting Ghost Blade, I probably should have got Lord Dominic's Regards because doing 2 damage just feels so good. Especially if you go stun them and get them with your E. Yay, my pot killed her. <laughs> and no, none of these people other than Gragas and Leona was ranked. And I'm talking about on the enemy team. It's nice at the 17 minute part I have that. Usually I have more kills but less CS. And I was typing. Like saying. Uh, her ult is down. Of course that Zed never seen any play like that. And was actually amazed on how I escaped. That was just a bit annoying. I set Zed up for that kill there. And if only my W was on way it was. Okay, I get a kill there. That was a nice gank too. And then Victor comes along. Don't know why I could kill him. In fact, I even tab to check see if he has any defense. Nope. In fact, I just let Zed take the kill. I don't need it. And if I would have stayed longer, I probably would have died. Red team's turret has been destroyed. And since Zed got the to top lane tower, I said, okay, time for me to both hate after I've bullied for you all long enough. Because really, no reason to stay top anymore for her. What I usually like to do is, uh, since there's usually no fighting going on, I like to just stay top and farm. No need for you to do anything else. Stay top, farm, kill the top lane a lot. If you can't kill the top lane, I'll do that good in lane. Just roam anywhere else and try to get kills. Scython picks up uh, later in the game. No light game, he will, his damage really picks up. <laughs> I also took that fruit because I was low on mana and I did not feel like basing. Blue team's turret has been destroyed. Yeah, I don't know why they ping me like that. There's no way I could get there faster. I was like, oh wait. 
I got Dusk Blade. Not Dusk Blade, Ghost Blade, but either way, nothing I could do. about dragon. Yeah, that was kind of stupid. I say Zed shouldn't have not followed him. I forgot about uh, Leona having exhaust. I would have stole the dragon too if she didn't exhaust me. That was a desperation attempt to actually get the dragon. Because I did not want them doing a lot of damage to my towers. I even do the fun thing. Get knocked back like that. A lot of stupid mistakes I make. Uh Mostly from just keep switching back and forth from scrolling through the mini map. Like not really paying attention type of things. I was like, oh no. I get denied again. Such aggravating sometimes. As Pantheon, your one and only job is to kill. That's all. Such aggravating. Sadly, by the time I finish my third item and really start on the fourth one, most of the time they just give up. But yeah, this ain't like the short one. This is a longer one. As you can tell. Red Team's turret has been destroyed. Yes, I seen them go to the bush, so I'm trying to lure them out.
Even Zed said, well, Zed said he can't take Tristan as she was too fed for him, but me and him can. Also, they're perfectly in my old game. And I finally get my right deserves being fed with the trigger. I told me to tank it, so I was tanking it, cause why not? The minions were coming anyway. Besides, we got us a nice shield called a Jana. So, yeah. Thanks to Grangus coming in like that, I was able to escape. But I had to leave or they would get the double buffs. And I did not want them to get a double buff. Even Zed was understanding of that idea, not letting the enemies get the double buff. Oh, here I'm gonna make another dumb play, but I'm not as dumb, but it's still dumb enough to tell what that's happening. I'm ulting in. Could not really get the kill there because she jumped. That's so sad. Just, just look at that. It's just waiting to be killed. Either way, I wasn't too bothered by it. So I tried to stay away long enough from the pump, huh. so the explosion wouldn't hurt me. I also hated that that could even knock me out of my dash, which would be my W. Even though it says you leap, it's a dash, which is stupid. Doing my thing like that. Yeah, I was a bit embarrassed after getting stunned like that. I told my team, don't even bother. Because, uh, because Viola was not there, we get three objectives off of that. That's a big plus in our favor. Though we do stay a bit too long because Viola is coming down. Guess she didn't want to try to kill the squishy gun. But yeah, I shouldn't hang about with that too long either today. I'm not going to get another kill. And I died. But yeah, if we didn't... If we didn't, uh... Stay around too long, we all wouldn't have been there to kill most of us.
I even typed in the chat saying, crap, we overstayed. But I really think it's okay that that happened. Didn't really matter. Though the shot that Stone Gold on me was a bit hefty. Fourth item, I was saying, fuck these tanks. Like, fuck Liana and Gragas, they're too annoying. And sadly, I accidentally got too far in the back with that. So, I did not get to hit anyone. But luckily, this happened. You know, Plankton can kill. I'll be good double. Oh, no, 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 no. We have double. It's like, they was pinging for a out of green with them saying, sure. Why not? I started, because why not? Like, holy shit, I forgot how much damage that one does. But mostly because I have no lifestyle items. Though what I'm doing with that vest there is I was building the thorn mail. Because fuck Fiora's heal. I'd rather her kill herself by attacking me to death. I was gonna build a dead man's play, but. I don't know what to be about more promising to me. And since uh, we had it took out an inhibitor in bot lane, Zed told us that I like the idea of push bot to win. I think we have to do just that. Maybe. I forget exactly how long this replay is, but you know, it looks like we do just that. Desperation, I come back. Just to take minutes. 